Niner, turn left heading 290, base leg heading, range 14 miles northeast of the field, range touchdown 18 miles. With a growing international network, excellent road and rail links, and half a million passengers each year, Southampton Eastleigh Airport is already a key part of transport in the south. But with an ambitious modernisation programme nearing completion, it's poised to become Europe's most successful regional airport. Southampton Eastleigh Airport offers a convenient local alternative for both domestic and international air travellers. There are 500 scheduled flights each week, linking the region to destinations throughout the United Kingdom and Europe. Within Britain, there are regular flights to, amongst others, Glasgow, Aberdeen, Edinburgh, Manchester, Liverpool, Leeds and the Channel Islands. And the airport's overseas routes are providing international travellers with a real alternative to travelling via Heathrow or Gatwick, with frequent flights to several European cities. From Southampton, there's a KLM service three times a day to Amsterdam. There are regular flights to Brussels. There are services to three destinations in France, Paris, Cherbourg and Caen. And during the summer months, there are flights to Mallorca. And through KLM's service to Amsterdam's Schiphol Airport and its comprehensive international network to places like New York, Australia and Hong Kong, passengers can connect with flights around the world and it's all made easier with through check-in to your final destination. But it's not just the growing route network that makes it a very real alternative to the London airports. Road, rail and ferry connections are second to none. The airport is only four miles from the centre of Southampton and a minute from the motorway network, with fast links to Portsmouth, Basingstoke, Bournemouth, Chichester, Newbury and further afield. Mainline rail connections are even closer, with Southampton Airport's Parkway station literally right alongside the terminal. It's the closest train-to-plane connection anywhere in Europe. The convenience of the airport goes much further than its comprehensive transport links. Parking is inexpensive and right alongside the terminal building. Good afternoon. Check-in times are short, so there's no need to hang around the departure lounge for an hour before your plane leaves. But if you do want to relax before a flight, there's the balcony buffet with a good selection of fresh food. Or you can have a drink in the bar. Or just sit and enjoy the panoramic view of a busy airport. The first size, which is a 50ml spray, is £24.50 or £44 for the 100ml spray. They are both sprays. For international travellers, the duty-free shop is always an essential port of call. The shop sells a wide range of goods at prices that are guaranteed to be lower than in the Channel Islands, and spirits are half what they cost in the high street. The airport has a team of highly professional staff. Their clear goal is to make journeys as quick and stress-free as possible, whilst ensuring the highest levels of safety and security. Flight information is available either on screen or from the team on the information desk. And there are numerous behind-the-scenes services, keeping the airport running smoothly, from air traffic control to aircraft refuelling, in-flight catering, aircraft servicing and baggage handling. It all adds up to a high quality and professional service for all customers. Southampton Eastleigh has always been popular with business travellers and the airport offers extensive services for corporate customers. There's an executive lounge with a minibus to ferry passengers right to the aircraft door. And for destinations not served by direct scheduled flights, there's help and advice on chartering your own aircraft. There's also the Airport Conference Centre, which provides a complete presentation and audio-visual facility for companies meeting clients here. For commercial users of the airport, there are also quick and efficient cargo handling facilities. The cargo team are well used to handling even the most unusual of freight, from racehorses to spare parts for ships, and all the paperwork is usually completed in just a few minutes. 
Southampton Eastleigh Airport is already a major transport centre in the region, but it has ambitious plans for the future. The airport's £21 million modernisation programme is nearing completion, giving the South the most modern regional airport in Europe. The new passenger terminal will be three times the size of the current one. All passenger facilities will be on the ground floor and walking distances will be kept to a minimum. Outside, there'll be improvements to the main approach road and there'll be new short and long-term car parks, all making life much easier for the passenger. And the new terminal will be just 50 metres from the railway station, even closer than it is at the moment. There'll be new buildings alongside the terminal, including a new fire station and control tower, as well as two hangars for executive jets and a cargo area. Some parts of the modernisation are already in place. The airport has a state-of-the-art radar system and there's a new fuel depot and aircraft parking stands. The result is an airport able to cope with the growth in the number of passengers expected in the years ahead. Current forecasts are that passenger numbers will double to around a million a year by 2005. But with people living nearby and a country park alongside, the redevelopment has been planned with the environment very much in mind. The airport aims to be one of the most environmentally friendly in Britain. There'll be fewer training flights in the area, noisier aircraft are being phased out, and there'll be strict limitations on the number of flights at night. The modernisation programme will provide a boost for the whole region, creating a state-of-the-art airport with high-quality facilities, a growing international network and the best of transport connections. But one thing won't change, the friendly professional service that customers have always enjoyed when they fly Southampton Eastleigh Airport. <laughs>